How's it going YouTube? It's Crazy Cracker here again and today I will be unboxing my vape box. For the guys who don't know how this works, you basically make a subscription, a monthly payment, they have multiple package options, and they ship you a vape box, a random box where you don't know what's inside. It's a mystery, the wow factor. Um, this is the best package they offer, which is $60 US. Um, they shipped to Canada for $17 with the conversion rate. I paid about $100 Canadian for this. So I'm hoping, I don't know what's inside. I'm hoping it's a good package. So here we go. Let's unbox this shit. Here we go. This is the vape box. Let's see what kind of goodies we got here. Whew, wish me luck. Oh, we got a shit ton of confetti on the top. Vape box sticker. It's a pretty cool sticker. Welcome to Vape Box. Welcome, Box. Greetings. Little invoice slip. Alright, man, this shit's gonna make a mess. Grab it out. Ooh. Looks like we got the Doge X2 for hardware. One of them. Pretty cool RDA. Looking forward to vaping on that. It's not bad. Next we have a mystery box. What could be inside? Ah. An ohm reader. Pretty cool little ohm reader, I guess. Batteries included. Random micro USB charger. Some blind tiger poly e juice. Um, 25-75 ratio, 6 milligram nicotine, nice dropper bottle, mmm, that smells good, kind of like a, a peri fruit flavor, next we have some Swedish fish, Kind of a weirder mango smell. Vaping caramel milk by uh, California California Company. Mmm, that smells pretty good. It's caramelly. Black Label Leprechaun Smack. Fucking smack for a leprechaun, buddy. Hmm. That one kind of smells like Kahlua. But either way. That's about it for the vape box. I could say overall, I'm... Kind of happy, it's the wow factor, you never know what you're going to get, so we got the Doge, Home Reader, four bottles of juice. So I'm going to have to test some of this juice now. In this dry bit.
just got a standard little micro coil going on right now. I'm gonna try this poly blind tiger because it definitely smells the best out of them. Out of the batch. Mm. That's a quite nice, pleasant vape. It's uh, reminds me of a bit Perry. Kind of candy. Not bad, not bad. Next up. Swedish Fish. This one smells pretty good. It's like mango. Ooh. Yep, it tastes like... Um, those little blue Swedish fish not bad next we have <coughs> caramel vape caramel milk Hmm, not bad. Kind of reminds me of a caramel tobacco. It's a little strong. Ooh, ooh. <coughs> Some black label. Leprechaun Smack. I'm a little scared to try this one. <clears throat> kind of overjuiced her up, but... Not bad, you know. I'm not too picky when it comes to my vape flavors, and this one's definitely not my preferred type, but it's not bad. Yeah. Alright, so that's about it for the vape box. Um, let me guys know, you guys let me know if you think it's worth the money, if you think it was a good vape box. Comments are appreciated, feedback's appreciated. Alright man, this is Crazy Cracker, stay tuned for more, peace out.